Here's one of the things that's driving me crazy is again tonight, the only goal in this game from O'Reilly, the only goal in this game is because he's able to float right through, mm. right through the middle of the ice. No one puts a body on him. And that happened not once, but twice in game four, Tarasenko's goal and then O'Reilly's goal. And, you know, you look at that, Keith, and you say, man, the Bruins are not physical enough in front of Tuca. They don't put a body on anyone. They let these guys float right to the net in case there's a rebound. And, and you would think that they would have learned yeah. from their mistakes in game four, letting that happen twice. And then yet again tonight in a game five, they do the same damn thing. And there's really no excuse for that. You've got to put bodies on guys. You can't allow them to just skate right down the middle of the ice and get a free path to Tuca on a rebound. You just yeah, can't that do one it. was frustrating. And I think it was DeBrusque, Pasternak, Bergeron were the forwards, and they just didn't get back enough because you noticed on that play, both McAvoy and Carlo were on the other side of the goal, right? They were right towards the boards, puckets flip back up, and there is, you know, O'Reilly to, to make them pay. There's a wraparound by 